I'm uh, going to do a quick sketch after a painting by Angre, a portrait painting, and I'm not going to do his drawing style. I'm, I'm, I'm going to make a very messy drawing. <laughs> So um, I'm not going even to bother to try to make it look neat or classical or anything. I'm just going to quickly put some hatchings on the paper and see where they go. <laughs> well. out. I'm going to zoom out a little bit so you can see a little better. Well, you see the tapes here. Right there. <laughs> I wanted to make a clean video, uh, make it look a bit cleaner, but anyway. It's a messy drawing, so let the video be a little bit messy as well. I'm going to define the mouth with crude hatchings, scribblings, whatever you call them. Doesn't matter really. As long as you do the job in defining a form and making things light and dark. Not sure if uh, Jean Dominique Angre would approve of this drawing style, but hey, he's dead and I'm not. <laughs> um, And slowly, uh, uh, the more I work on this drawing, I hope that you can see her face emerging through all those lines and hatchings. Suggesting her hair a little bit as well. And I'm now, and now I want to adjust the nose a little bit. Something's a bit off in the angle. Or something wasn't right here. Taking another pencil.
and now I have to work on the eyes a bit more. values adjusting a little bit this is the lightest area followed by this here and the rest is slightly darker so this seems light but it must be a bit darker than this for example so you can and this as well so the light the white of the paper is is too light actually to to, to keep it untouched in that area And after the first quite crude and rough beginning, some try to bring subtlety in the drawing. And it must be in the st whole structure of these sort of hatchings, so uh, I don't want to change style in drawing, but I want to work in phases. So first there, there is this crude beginning, and then there is this phase in which I try to, uh, yeah improve the drawing quality and keep the liveliness of it but also add detail to it Some more darkness. Just that light, you can see it a little bit better, I think. I can see it a little bit better. <laughs> some darkness around her face and it gives more atmosphere if you only have her face then it's not really working well Mm -hmm. 
just needs some more accentuation below her eyes. working on the tonal values now. I think I made her chin a little bit too small, but I'm not sure. And at this moment I get the most effect from adjusting the tonal values in her face. So I'm not really hatching now, but uh, with this, a bit of a blunt pencil, there's not a sharp point, I am adding total values all over her face. And this is just a phase in which I just go on and on adding tonal values and uh, trying to adjust this drawing in such a way that her face emerges. And I want another pencil. I'm going to pick one with a sharp point if I can find one. I think I have one. So making this darker something under the paper here if you if you are working on the, if you put your drawing on a surface try not to have all kinds of little things on that it can distort your drawing Get the tonal values right. More or less. And 
this is uh, 300 grams color copy paper so uh, I would not be able to do th these kind of hatchings, layering of hatchings on normal let's say printer paper because that would have been uh, broken it, it, it would have had holes already, I think. But this paper the can it can have a lot more than the usual uh, printer paper. So when it's available, you can use it, you know. And uh, I'm looking at my drawing, looking at things that I need to do before finishing it because. I think, well, I don't want to work too long on this drawing from now. I think uh, the drawing seems to have some character. I think it has some character. The lighting is a bit off here, but as you can see, uh, it distorts a little bit the, the image, but anyway. A hint of her finger here. And where can I put accentuations which makes this a better drawing? And slowly I'm approaching the face that I say, well, I need to stop soon. <laughs> And I think I, uh, well, I don't, just a little adjustments here and there. Oftentimes at the moment that I want to say, well, I'm, I'm stopping now, I see something.
Mm -hmm. Shine on her hair. And I think I leave it at this. Yeah, thank you for watching and if you like these kind of videos uh, you can uh, think of subscribing perhaps, really appreciate it. Thank you.